Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel, this is Ling Ling and I'm super pleased to have you here again. In today's wonderful episode, I'm going to explore with you a beautiful tour in the Dior shop at the Canton Road in Tim Sha Tre in Hong Kong at the Harbour City. And this is definitely one of my most favorite Dior boutiques in whole Hong Kong as they have a wide a range of variety of bags, luxury items like accessories, anything that has to do with Dior, even they have like Dior beauty items like the perfumes and then on the second floor they have like the ready to wear and this service is really fantastic. Oh, and also I forgot to mention that they have like Dior Maison items available at the second floor which you shouldn't miss out as well because they have beautiful tableware like plates, cups and even picnic sets from the Dior Maison with beautiful pattern and every now and then they change the collection because they also have like seasonal items. For those who have been following my channel loyally, you must know that I have previously also uploaded a video about the preview of the fall collection 2024. Back then they didn't have so many items available yet, but yet I could show my audience a little preview yet from the just arrived items which was only visible for like certain customers like valuable customers like me and today i'm going to show you much more from the existing collection because there's a lot more that has arrived in the shop so for those who haven't seen my previous video about the preview of the full collection 2024 i will be happy to refer you back to my video i will put the link down below in the comment section and also in the description box so that you have a look and also in between i've been traveling to tokyo and i have dedicated a beautiful video about the shopping experience at the dior boutique in isetan in shinjuku but also at the world's largest dior boutique in the world which is in ginza 6 shopping mall where you can indulge yourself with five floors of dior shopping experience also they have a wonderful dior cafe at the fourth floor located that you shouldn't miss out if you want to know more details about all of this then also check out all my dior video about shopping in tokyo i will also drop down the link of this video below so that you guys can have a look thank you everybody for your endless support to watch my videos about the dior luxury events preview events unboxing and many more and i'm so happy that today i can share more of the new collection with all of you you probably have noticed while like browsing through my video i mean well that there's a lot of new collection from the miss dior collection which i have explained in my previous video it is inspired by the 60s and we see a lot of Miss Dior logo in a new collection. This Miss Dior logo, we can see this in a graffiti style and we can see this logo appearing like on the pockets of like the short jeans or the skirts, but also like the denim jackets and trench coats. We can see that reflecting on many of their luxury goods like bags, handbags or even like the tote book bags. The style is a little bit more louder because of this graffiti logo compared to what we are previously used to from the Dior collection. But however, this is the iconic launch of the new collection, the graffiti logo. And also on the other hand, there is another logo available, which is like the repetitive Miss Dior logo, which we find a lot back in their longer shirts, silk shirts, and also in the scarves, but also like on the backdrop of the shop decoration and many more ready to wear. So here you can see at a glimpse in the background, the Miss Dior logo on the left side of the wall. I'm going to start with a review about the handbag section. And then later on, I'm going to talk about the ready to wear and the shoes at the end. So here I'm starting off with the beautiful Himalaya Lady Dior bag, which is a very iconic and highly sought after luxury handbag created by the French 
fashion house. It is renowned for its exquisite craftsmanship, timeless design, and very rare materials used in its production. The unique coloration of the Himalaya Lady Dior bag is achieved through a meticulous and specialized dyeing process applied to the exotic crocodile skin used in its construction. The color transition from a pale, almost white hue at the top to a darker gray or charcoal tone at the bottom is meant to mimic the ethereal beauty and natural gradient of the Himalayan mountains, hence the name Himalaya. The Lady Dior is one of the most top sellers from Dior's house and this also because it was a endorsement previously from Lady Di from the Royal House. And that's why these kind of bags, they have many times different kind of beautiful artistic finishings. Previous white bag has a beautiful embroidery from the beads and then this bag, which is a lizard bag, has like a special finishing. Something new from the new collection is that the handles from the Lady Dior bag, they have a different kind of leather than the bag itself so that there is a little bit of a contrast. As you can see here in this bag, the handle has like a different material than the bag which is overall in canache pattern. Here you can find a more wider variety of like the Lady Dior bags in exotic leather but also like I mentioned the top handle which is different than the bag itself. One of the new arrived tote bags as well is this one, it is very easy to match. And here we have like the two very classic oblique patterned bags. The left bag is called the groove bag and then the right one is the very classic 30 Montan chain bag. They have this groove bag in two sizes in 20 and 25 and also besides the oblique pattern they have it in the canache pattern as well in lambskin. So moving to this section you can see more of the Miss Your logo collection in graffiti pattern like this smaller handbag and also the big tote bag which is like in shocking pink with like the big Miss Dior logo. And of course on the left side you can find the classical Lady D Joy bag which is a new variant on like the Lady Dior bag but which is already out for like almost two years. The Lady Dior bags on top of the shelf which is in like black and shocking pink. And also what's new in this season is this new kilted pattern on the Lady Dior bag. And to your bag and also they have it on some Lady D Joy bags. As for the tote bags, they come in a huge variety of colors and designs. So besides a very eye-catching, shocking pink tote bag, which has like the Miss Dior logo, we have it in different colors as well. And also with the smaller graffiti logo and then with the uh, repetitive pattern on the background. There's a lot of choices and also in different colors available. Previously, I've mentioned about the exotic leather handles, which is combined with the canache pattern. So the handles are different in uh, material than the overall bag. If you want to know more about the exotic bags in general, I will refer you back to one of my very extensive review about the Maroquinerie event which is all about the bespoke bag event you had a choice there to tailor make your own bag in a desired exotic leather in different finishing and also colored combination with beautiful with beautiful and exceptional uber charms so if you want to know more about this i will refer you back to the previous video and i will drop the link below in the comment section and right here in front of us, we can see here two bags in different sizes of the Ange bag, A-N-G-E. This bag was only launched this year. And I have done a review about this bag in one of my previous videos when it was only in the preview event available. And in this campaign picture, we can see in black the Lady Dior bag in the newest kilted pattern. They also have this kilted pattern in the white Lady D Joy bag next to it. Here an overview of the newest colors of the Lady Dior bags, which are very classical and very soft. These soft kind of powder shades are very elegant and truly beautiful. And then here you can see on the top shelf, on the right side, there's this new bag available, which is called the Small 30 Montan Avenue Top Handle Bag. And just like the Lady Dior bags, they have it in the very soft powder pink and baby blue color, then in patent leather. 
And here we see a very beautiful, soft, nudish pink color patent leather My Dior bag. And this version bag has already been in the collection for a while. And next to it, we can see with the golden chain, which is also like a wallet on chain, which is called the Dior Miscaro bag. These two bags are smaller and very practical in its usage because it's a wallet on chain. The chain of the Miss Caro bag is adjustable. You could carry it on your shoulder or just cross body. And the chain of the My Dior top handle bag is totally removable. So here at the very end in the background you can see the new Miss Dior flap bag. For this Miss Dior flap bag they also have it in these two colors soft pink and soft baby blue but also they have one which is more loud with like the graffiti pattern and here she's showing me the interior of the bag to show you how much can actually fit inside it's not too much but it is good enough for like your necessarily things that you can take out it's more like an easy going bag and you can use it for daily wear or even for an evening out the interior has like a zipper compartment as well on the side so you can also put some valuable belongings there and it has like a golden clasp which contains the Miss Dior logo. It is a shoulder bag. Also in the lambskin we see like the kilted pattern of the Miss Dior logo. So it got a lot of logo not only on the clasp but also on the calf leather. The color is amazing though. And you can see here below in the cabinet, your three other My Dior top handle bags, which has like different letter color combinations together involved, which are also very interesting. And the color are very soft, like pink and baby blue and beige color. So the beige color has like a white top handle, as you can see. So it's a bit more playful. And then for this nudish color, you can see it's also in patent leather, which is very beautiful, I think. The bag itself is also super light as it's like a wallet on chain, but because it's not just a wallet, it has a chain. So you can also use it as an evening bag. So it's very versatile and it's also very handy for when you travel. So here she's going to show us like the compartments from inside. There are two compartments and there's also a little pocket on the side for maybe your credit cards. And the charms on the closure are also like very cute. The chain is fully removable so you can also take it out just by using the top handle. The My Dior bag wallet on chain is a versatile and stylish accessory that combines the functionality of a wallet with the convenience of a crossbody bag. The My Dior bag wallet on chain is likely a modern interpretation of the classic Dior handbag updated with a compact and practical design that allows for hands-free carrying. The wallet and chain style has become extremely popular in recent years for its convenience and versatility, making it a popular choice for women on the go. She's also holding here a beautiful card holder in lambskin. And here she's showing us a beautiful canache pattern kilted card holder. And it is made from lambskin. The pores are a little bit like bigger as you see, and it's very soft. And she's also showing us here the other wallet on chain, which is called like the, the Dior Caro pouch. This Dior Caro pouch is also a very popular item. And it also has this kilted canache pattern in the lambskin and a smaller Dior logo, uh, if you compare it with the Dior Miss Caro which has like a bigger logo and also another chain which is included with some pearls so that's the difference so in total she's showing me like three different kind of wallets on chain the first one was the my dior top handle bag the second one was the miss caro bag and this one is the caro pouch which is a little bit more simple 
the Dior Caro pouch is a practical and elegant creation. Crafted in beautiful lambskin with macro canache stitching, it features an antique gold finished metal CD signature flap that reveals a compartment to hold all the essentials. She's showing me the difference in leather between the light blue bag and then the nude skin color one. The light blue one is made from calf leather which is a little bit more harder than the lambskin version. The nude color one, the wallet on chain is made from a lambskin leather it's a bit more softer and also the pores from the skin is different it's kind of like bigger than the one from the calf skin and the other mighty or bag i've shown before the mighty or top handle bag is made from patent leather which is like a shiny type of leather because of the finishing so besides the beautiful handbags and wallets on chain we have also a new arrived item which is the backpack it is very cute it also has like a golden handle on top of it so that you can hold it there and hang it also somewhere it's a beautiful in calf leather as well you have the smaller version and they also have a bigger size and now i'm going to check out this beautiful new arrived bag in soft pink patent leather it is the small 30 montan avenue top handle bag i think this color goes very well with any kind of outfit so it's very easy to match i do compliment the color a lot and it also comes with a strap which is also removable she's going to strap this strap later on so that i can have a try on because you can hand carry this just like you using the top handle but if you put the strap on then you can wear it cross body as well so it's like a multifunctional bag without a strap it looks more like an evening bag and with the cross body version it is more easy and convenient for like daily wearing and i think the golden cd logo goes very well with the color of the patent leather this is a total new launched bag that hasn't existed before in the Dior collection and is like a newer type of the existing 30 Montan bag but now more curvaceous so this is called the 30 Montan Avenue top handle bag it is named after the Maison's flagship in Paris. It is curvy in all the right places. The new bag comes only in a single size with dimensions similar to that of the East-West silhouette at 22.5 cm wide and 12.5 cm high. It is featuring an antique gold finish CD twist lock clasp and opens to a double gusset compartment while the rear slip pocket enhances its practicality. The leather top handle and also adjustable removable strap allows the small bag to be carried by hand or worn over the shoulder or crossbody. So here you can see me wearing it crossbody in front of the mirror and you can see the color is beautiful and it gives like a little bit of contrast when you wear a lighter color like white. I've now reached to the end of the first part of this episode about the new Miss Your Fall collection, about the new launched bags, and in the next chapter I'm going to talk about the ready to wear from the Fall 2024 Miss Your collection. And also there will be some shoes available. I hope you guys enjoyed this first chapter of my new episode about the 2024 Fall collection from Dior. And I hope to see you soon in my next chapter that is explaining more about the ready to wear and the shoes. So please stay tuned and don't miss out on the next chapters. Thank you so much and if you find this interesting don't forget to subscribe, comment and like as well to not miss out anything in future. See you very soon. And for those who haven't seen my previous videos yet, here's an extra invitation to watch them. My previous video about a special preview in the shop and also a special event in the Dior Villa in Sosen Hill. Join also my special VIP tours in the shop and I got some nice unboxing videos about some Dior items as well. And there's a lot more coming in future to share with you also. Don't forget to subscribe, follow, comment and like. And also hit the bell so that you don't miss out anything in future. Thank you so much and see you very soon.